Hey guys, I'm Julia Gerges and I'm about to walk you through my tournament diary of, of the Nature Valley Classic in Birmingham behind the scenes of the week. Here are some of my stories from the favorite photos of that week. So this is me serving, I think for the first time after three days of rain in Birmingham um, that I got the chance to hit on grass court. It was very strange because um, you haven't hit on grass court for yeah quite a while, I think almost a year then. And um, well, we got to hit with four people on the court, not much court time, but um, I think overall I was uh, quite happy with the ball striking I had and also with my surf because it's uh, never easy to really um, come from, out, uh, from indoors to outside. And um, no, I, I felt pretty good what I remember. <laughs> That's my um, workout photo from the gym in the hotel because we, we had a lot of rain in the first days. Um, so I decided um, to go with a light gym session in the morning. So that's what I prefer sometimes to do on um, rainy days that I stay um, in the hotel gym, do my workout and wait until the afternoon. And um, that was kind of the day where I really tried to use it um, for a lot of mobility activation. So I was ready for the afternoon practice. Uh, that picture says it pretty much all. That was after match point in the semi-final against Petra Matic. Um, I was pretty relieved because I didn't have very good months before. I was injured and um, didn't really get the feeling back for my game. And um, then it was the first week on grass again. And um, yeah, it was just a great week overall. So I was very relieved when the match point was done in that semi-final and um, that I was able to play Ash in the final then. Well, that was actually the first time Ash and I played doubles together. Um, it was a one thing on our bucket list, but um, back then she was always playing with Casey Delacqua. And so there was not really room for me since they both were very successful together and also very good friends. So for me, it was uh, great to be able to share the court with her in Birmingham. It's lots of fun with her. And um, especially the whole week was just in every terms, very special to be able to share with Ash and her family as well. That's a picture from um, the final when Ash beat me and became world number one. Um, we just met at the net and I just congratulate her for, well, becoming world number one for that title. Um, but um, mostly she's one of my best friends on the tour for, for a very long time. And I know what she has been through, um, where she's coming from. And um, well, we respect each other a lot. So. For me, it was very special sharing this uh, moment with her um, becoming number one in the world. Um, well, it's it's a dream of everyone's player. And um, if you can share the court with one of your best friends, that makes it even more special. That's uh, one nice photo with um, a nice Porsche. <laughs> um, well, it's, it's a great sponsor of me. Um, I'm very thankful for having a, a global sponsor as Porsche in my team and um, already for a long time. Um, well, it, we, we work very well together and um, it's a great partnership over all the years and they provide me um, on tournaments um, a nice car to come um, to the site, uh, go to the airport and also just uh, to the hotel and um, in different cities um, so I can see something and always um, being on a nice um, yeah way back to the hotel and feeling very comfortable and fast. <laughs> well that's a photo from my um, media throughout that week. Um, after every match you have uh, press conferences and nice interviews so um, this one actually shows how much um, I've enjoyed my week in Birmingham, um, how well I've played because um, when you're always smiling and, and laughing at an interview, um, I think it um, shows you how, how good you were maybe and how good you're feeling. And um, yeah, just in general, it was overall a great week, um, including Meteor. <laughs> Here it was Kids Day. Um, I don't remember which day exactly it was, but um, those little sweet girls, they were patiently waiting after my practice to get an autograph. So. That's always very nice if you can uh, put a smile on the little kid's face and um, really make them happy. So I really enjoy when kids are waiting or in general fans are waiting. Um, that's something special and also, also makes you a bit proud if they really want to have a signature from you.